In this tech tip, we're going to show you how to calculate CFM using the gas temp rise method. If you have taken the NAIT test recently, you've seen a page of many equations to use to calculate various things. So let's look at the equation to calculate the gas heat rise method. In order to calculate CFM for a gas furnace, we need some information to plug into the equation. So the equation for CFM on a gas furnace is cubic feet per hour times BTUs per cubic foot times our furnace efficiency divided by 1.08 times the temperature difference. So using the values from our previous two minute tech tip videos on clocking the gas meter and temporize, Let's plug in the values needed to make this calculation. The values needed are 81.82 cubic feet per hour, 1000 BTUs per cubic feet, and a 65 degree temperature rise. So our resolution to this equation is to take our 81.82 BTUs per hour times 1000 BTU heat content times 96% efficiency of the furnace, divided by 1.08 times our temperature rise of 65 degrees. When we multiply and divide that out, our calculation comes out for this gas furnace to be 1,122 CFM using the gas temp rise method. Go to arefco.com for more videos, like, Subscribe and check back every week for new videos.